So we know that time and again when we use animals, the results are misleading, give kind of a false sense of security, but it's just something we've historically done. It's my job here to be advocating for animals in laboratories and ultimately ending the use of animals for research and testing. My career, I guess, began working in a monkey breeding and research facility for several years. I just really was shocked by how things were done, uh, how the animals were treated, the quality of the science, and thought there has to be a better way. I think people assume because primates are so like us, they must be the best model. And we proved that is not the case when we ended chimpanzee research in the United States. Chimpanzees are the animal most genetically similar to us. We've proven that using dogs in certain toxicity tests is not predictive of humans. And that is true for other animals. The estimate is 90 to 95% of drugs fail in human trials after relying on animal tests. No one can think that that is okay. In some cases, we would argue that we're not getting the information we need from the animal test. We shouldn't be doing it, but it is to check a box to get a product approved. We've seen that with cosmetics testing. The industry agrees with us. Everyone agrees that animals shouldn't be suffering from cosmetics, yet it continues. The entire European Union, India, dozens of countries have taken steps to eliminate cosmetics testing on animals. We were also the last country to end the use of chimpanzees in research. It is time for the United States to catch up. One of the harder parts of my job was when I needed to pick 10 males who were a year and a half old to two years old to send out to different laboratories. And I'll never forget, I went to uh, the National Library of Medicine and there was a paper that was talking about monkeys being used in painful dental experiments that I was reading. The monkeys used were the ones they sent. When people see the animals, connect with them as individuals, makes all the difference. Once people learn the fate of the animals that might even have been for their cosmetic that they're wearing have that drive to continue to make change.